Crayfisher from Captain Crayfish. Uh, this is my second region that I want to explore. It is Cactus Canyon. Uh, Cactus Canyon. When I first saw this region, I thought to myself, this reminds me of Las Vegas. Uh, I really love the architecture design in here. It looks very cool. The designers have taken it into great effect. How one side can be shaded and the other side of it's light of the sun. I think that's, I think that's brilliant. It's one thing I really enjoy the land. Um, basically, it's a gigantic grid. Um, a grid format, which is a pretty cool, which is going to be a quite a, an easy build. Uh, you might notice there that um, when I look at things like the fire, um, it's done in a pretty basic grid. Um, this is something quite standard that you'll see a lot of build a lot of builders use. They'll just cluster your their main um, buildings in a central location and then build everything around it to make use of um, the res the specialized resources like the Royal Garden, the Ed, you've got the central train station and I've got the summer camp. And it's all built central, it's all central to the main city structure which gives you a greater use of um, the way that these areas here update population zones just like that. So um, one of the things I'm not happy with is the fact that I've got these um, specialised regions on the, on the outskirts which doesn't capitalise really on the, the the zone of influence there. So uh, somewhere along the line, I think I'm going to update this and shift things around to make use, better use of these zones here so that I can increase my population a lot more efficiently. That's my goal anyway. Again, like I mentioned in one of the videos, I've cannibalized my, my city center, my city captain, my, sorry, my capital, and I've moved specialized resources from the capital into my regions to build up the populations to open up other regions <clears throat> and basically it's a format that I've um, continually done uh, I want to expand on this one and give it a more Vegasy look so it's going to be like a big party place, party central um, so again uh, in the future you'll see this is going to be updated a lot more oops I've just got something updating just there oh got another one cool so that's two. Um, uh, I can't quite expand up here only because I'll show you why if I go fire. Um, I haven't quite got enough money to buy in the um, large units used to support those populations. Um, so I'll be uh, gradually uh, shifting things around to make better use of the zone of influence that's just in here. Um, Cactus Capital, uh, again, the main, this is, oh, let's see, is uh, car parts, I really like the idea that they use car parts, and you can see that uh, I've tried my best to keep this factory running continually, building these engine parts here, uh, the engine parts can get 10,000 simoleons per five, and you can also see that I'm starting to extend sideways. I can expand some of the zones, but I'm going to hold off until I decide that we little things. I don't think that in the temple goes with the whole desert thing. Um, again, I want to keep my rules and um, character with the, with the zones, so I'm not going to be putting any other types of buildings into these regions. Just to, just to keep with that character of it. I, um, hints, get the city storage out. I'm going to keep telling you this. Keep, get that city storage out. Because the city storage allows you to stockpile resources. And stockpile tons of them. Uh, you can see, uh, like my other zone, I have the city storage in place. This one here. Uh, it costs 5,000 units, but it's worth it because it gives you an increased capacity of 20 and adds to your ability to stock for resources so that you can keep those factories um, running continually 
And that's the key to making money here. It's running continually. I'm at a point now where I can keep the simoleon amount up around the 50,000 consistently. And um, tr I'm trying my best not to use real sim cash in here. Um, I'm hoping later on the designers figure out something here because uh, a lot of your extra coinage goes towards these um, these like cactus simoleons but I think that's going to be a problem in the future because you can only have so many of these um, things here you can only have so many in a zone so as you build your populations uh, it's going to, you know, they need to rethink it so I hope you like that, leave some comments, I'll get back to it again